beyond the crime scene tape tragedy unfolded in this neighborhood in Rodeo. What I heard was the gunshots that it's I It's common to hear news gunshots. of violence and other crimes in this rough neighborhood of Rodeo, California. To be honest with you, even though I live here, I don't, I don't hang out here. Despite these conditions, Delia took to the streets to share her faith. We were crossing the street, me and my husband, holding, holding our invitation. And a guy saw me on, on the cross street and say, you guys need help? Across the street was Rico, a community leader who wanted to help. We were distributing like between 9 to 10 in the morning and people are still, you know, there's like a few people on the streets. So, and then he said, you are, you know, in your situation, and he looked at me, you know, I'm disabled, so I'll do it for you. I said, no, 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 I can do it. In a wheelchair since her stroke in 2012, Delia has not allowed it to slow her down. I prayed to God, I said, while I am waiting for your answer, for my full recovery, I said, use me, use me. Said, Whatever you want me to do, I'll do it. So what followed on a Saturday morning in Rodeo was a result of Delia allowing God to use her as his instrument. The kids are all having fun. Um, they've had way too much candy. <laughs> the INC Giving Project event, A Help Up, was held in Rodeo, California's YMCA. It's an event that offers free food and services, such as health and dental checkups, as well as a counseling booth. All of these services were staffed by the INC Giving Project, an outreach program of the Iglesia Ni Cristo Church of Christ. If somebody feels like they're feeling down, you know, they can read them some Bible verses and nice. give them, lift them up a little. Okay, one. And Delia's determination to go out to the people had an immense effect. With this, that we went to their own community then it's so easy for them to, to come. And that's exactly what our Lord Jesus Christ have done, wherein He's the one who went to the people. Today is special because it's an Einstein giving project, but it's special in a way that it started because of one invitation. Delia stayed in contact with Rico, developing a relationship she never expected with this Rodeo community. So that's my role. I, you know, I, I follow up every day. I call them. I said, hey, we have worship service. Hey, we have another community. We called it community um, outreach. And in an effort to show their love, the INC giving volunteers from the local congregation of San Pablo united to provide these residents of Rodeo this help up. without spiritual awareness or spiritual spirituality that they need it more than ever now. It was the best thing I could have done for myself today. I'm so glad that I came over here. You feel? Feel, I feel great, exhilarated. You're asking for something, you're asking for my the time. time. But, you know, it gives, it gives me hope, you know, it makes me feel good. It was just really a good blessing for me and for the kids and hopefully for this whole community. With Delia's persistence, this community now has the opportunity to learn about the truth. It's great that because she, she goes out into the community and looks for everybody to you know, come to these events, and I think that's amazing. So I'm using this, my disability, as my inspiration. Yeah, it's a blessing in disguise. And since that first meeting, the Rodeo community have been welcomed to Bible studies. It wasn't long until they formed a friendship with the INC Giving volunteers. We just had good rapport, I had good connections with them. 
we hope that they can understand that this church, True Church, is, is, really, is really here for them. We really, truly love and care for them. I know that it's a blessing from Jesus that you're here. This is just a very positive um, Saturday. It's, it's, it's really good for the neighborhood. It brings everybody together. What started as a simple act of kindness and faith turned into a day that gave the residents of Rodeo, California some good news and a reason to smile in their community. You weren't disappointed, huh? No, no disappointment. <laughs> On behalf of the local congregation of San Pablo, my name is Michelle Soriano reporting for the INC Giving Show.